Half a day. Welcome to another session of the Guam Contractors Association's GCA Today. And today we have a very special guest, Mr. Joe Ariola with Advanced Management. Half a day, Joe. Hey, Welcome. All right. Thank, thank you. you for being yeah. here. So please tell us uh, who you are, uh, what company you work with, and all about your products and services and how we can take care of the beautiful Paradise Island of Guam. Oh, absolutely. Uh, thank you for inviting me yep. uh, on this uh, I guess this show or whatever yes, you yes. And uh, as far as what we do at Advanced Management, we're a multifaceted uh, okay. company. We, we do a lot of things uh, from simple home inspections, uh, carpentries, HVAC, plumbing, uh, a lot of renovations, uh, a complete remodeling. In fact, we are now doing the uh, Ross renovation. Oh, Palm outstanding. Yes, right, we're, uh, right on. we're about to complete that. I say by next month we should be uh, wrapping that uh, work out. And of course, many other small jobs in between uh, that we keep our boys busy. So again, you know, we're multifaceted. We do a lot of things, and uh, I guess basically what people need to do if they want to know, uh, just call us. You know, and uh, we have a staff uh, on board, or control center, uh, that will take your calls, and then they'll screen it, vet it to the appropriate technician. Okay. okay. And then from there, we do the assignments that go out and do the work. So you, you mentioned with advanced management, all of these different types of services that you do for the people of Guam, uh, whether I'm a homeowner, a hotel owner, apartment owner, contractor, small, large, uh, medium size, you can take care of us. I mean, from renovations as well, is there a, a specific service that today we can concentrate on that you'd like to promote and inform the people of Guam? What uh, you would like to share? Well, yes. Uh, actually, we uh, we started just recently the uh, home inspections. Okay. And these are basically geared towards maybe people looking into buying homes. Oh. Okay. Or even selling. Nice. So we do a, a complete inspection: the structural, the plumbing, the electrical, uh, to see the uh, the worthiness of the house, and then we provide a report. And then from there, it's up to the the either the seller or buyer. Uh, to decide how they want to move forward with their clients. You know, it's funny you mentioned that. Now, in that regard, because next week, as a matter of fact, I have a, a, an appointment with my realtor to ta take a look at a, a home, a small home, to possibly invest in for one of my kids or uh, a rental uh, mm -hmm. home. Now, what does it cost for someone like me, just your average Joe out there, it says, hey, advanced management, uh, I'm looking at this house. Uh, how long will it take? Um, and what would that cost be? The, the cost is based on square footage okay. Okay, and of course the location of the area, how far we have to travel. <clears throat> I can't give you off the top of my head the exact cost, but normally we have a chart okay. that we look at and then, then we'll compare that. And then we make an appointment. Uh, we will have uh, myself, an electrician, and then a structure engineer. Nice, join nice. Us, and then we'll do the inspection. It'll take anywhere, uh, depending on the size of the unit, you know, standard home, maybe on two hours or so. Nice. Uh, yeah, any nice. bigger than that would take longer. Uh, it takes maybe three, maybe about a week to get a full report. Okay. Uh, which includes all the uh, photos and identifying the faults if there's any. Wow. Uh, any uh, compromise on the structural integrity or the plumbing or the electrical and stuff like that. So it kind of, it helps the buyer. Or the seller. Yeah, yeah, yeah both parties. Both yeah, parties, yeah. yeah. And negotiate a good, fair deal. Because Absolutely. if I'm the buyer Absolutely. and it has cracks on the roof, cracks on the mm -hmm. floor, cracks everywhere, plumbing, electrical yeah. issues, it helps me as the buyer bring it down. And then also the seller realizes like, wow, I didn't even realize that this mm -hmm. was here. And as the buyer, I'm the one paying for that service. Yeah. And it, I just help the seller. Exactly. We, we stay neutral in these things. We don't. Uh, we do not recommend uh, any repairs to any company and stuff. Uh, we recommend that you know these may need to be addressed. Okay. Uh, and then again, it's up to the the buyer and seller to do whatever they need to do. We just identify uh, structurals, electricals, and uh, and, and plumbing. plumbing. And yeah. Now, <clears throat> when it comes to plumbing, I mean, this is something we cannot see because it's in the wall. It's underground. Mm -hmm. Is there a service that you guys also have that, you know, it, this is, this home was built in the 80s, mm -hmm. early 80s, mm -hmm. late 70s. What if the plumbing needs repair? I mean, we're talking, I mean, that's a serious job there. Would you be able to detect certain things that the plumbing is still okay, it might be okay, or complete replacement? The uh, As far as the plumbing, most of them are concealed okay, okay. Within, within the CMU wall. So 
We can't really do a visual inspection okay. on it. Okay. Uh, well, we do have a service where we provide leak detection services. Outstanding. Uh, we're using the uh, latest uh, state-of-the-art technology to find leaks. Right now, with our leak detection, uh, it's very popular with the pools. Uh, okay. We have uh, we have several customers that are calling in, even non-customers, yeah, you know, regular customers are calling in to to look at their pools because their water bill starts to rise. Oh, when well, that goes up, okay, there's your hint, red you know, flag. <laughs> you know, you get a four, five hundred, six hundred dollar water bill. Yeah, something needs to Some, be done. Yes, yeah, so we wrong. do a lot of uh, leak detections and jacuzzis and residential. Uh, we also do apartment and condos. It's a little bit complicated because. Yeah. If the unit works out of a common area meter, then you have to shut the entire meter off to everybody. Correct. Uh, if it's uh, sub meter, then yeah. it uh, it simplifies things with apartments. We're also planning to expand the services on a larger scale. Okay. Uh, maybe offer this to uh, GWA, uh, the military, uh, Navy, Air oh, Force. Outstanding. Uh, bigger pipes. You know, yes. Uh, larger distribution price in there. But in the meantime, right now we are doing uh, pools and. Uh, Homes, apartments, okay. and condos. You know that's that's a pretty good. Um, now with all those services, and the, it, it takes a specific skill set to be that plumber, to be that electrician, to be that uh, masonry person, uh, put on tiles, uh, put together cabinets. You guys, advanced management. I could just call that one company. You guys, I could call Mr. Ariola. I want to renovate my home. And you deal with all of those different skill sets. You have that available? You have yes, that resource? Yes, sir. We absolutely do. Again, Outstanding. We have our carpenters, we have masons, electricians, certified electricians. Oh, so you have them on staff? On staff. And we oh, have two whoa. engineers uh, on staff, actually three. Uh, I have an electrical engineer, a civil engineer, and a mechanical engineer. So that three disciplines there. We can cover basically almost anything on the island. So uh, then that begs the question, I mean, how many do you, advanced management, how many on staff do you guys have? How many of these people total? I mean, from from the plumber to the grass cutter to, <laughs> to everyone. Oh, geez. Uh, yeah, count. yeah, yeah. <laughs> let, let's get that calculator out yeah. here. Uh, wow, uh, that's I, awesome. I think we have approximately uh, about 20, 19 to 20. Outstanding. Posts, yeah. Thank and you. that, you know, those 20 people that you employ, they also have families too. Oh, yes. And, you know, it, it's a beautiful thing. Every time, and I've all done all these different interviews, and it's such a great feeling to know that we have another 20 people with these skill sets that are locally born and bred yes. here in Guam that can take care of my electrical work, my plumbing work, and we don't necessarily have to bring in all these other uh, foreign workers, we can all work together. So there's a, a tip and advantage for these larger contractors to say, hey, advanced management has 20 skilled people. Let, let me see if I could get in touch with Mr. Ariola and, and hook, we work together to make this, everything work. There are times that we, uh, we need additional help. Yep. This is where we go to uh, employment agencies. Okay. You know, and of course, most of them, or a lot of them, are local employees. Okay. Uh, you know, temporary work and stuff like that when we get overwhelmed. Okay. But to keep our staff uh, fully employed, gainfully employed, okay. uh, you know, Monday through Friday, five days a week, uh, they're happy, they take care of their family. And hopefully, I, I mean, I, I pray that we all work together to even uh, grow those skill sets with as every year we have high school graduates mm -hmm. and they're looking for work you know mom and dad here I am me and my wife are you know when we see our kid graduate listen here boy <laughs> it's time for you to welcome yourself to the real world and can I maybe let's say I have a graduate and he, he wants to work on pools he likes that that's a dream of his or whatever the case may be I can call you and say hey Joe you know, I have a son, I have a daughter who likes to work outside, you know, uh, do you always see the, that influx of, of, let's say, younger generations wanting to learn these skill sets? Some do. Yeah. Some are actually uh, summer programs for the okay. students. Uh, we are open to hiring uh, summer employees. You know? Outstanding. Uh, in fact, we were just working with uh, the Department of Labor yep. because there are certain age groups that we have to be very careful on our hiring process, not the process, but how we employ them. Uh, there are certain rules, regulations that we must adhere to okay. for underage uh, minors and stuff like that. 
Uh, I think below 16, there's a certain criteria, 16 and above, okay. there's a certain criteria. So we, we work uh, closely with the Department of Labor for yeah. guidance on, yeah. right on. Uh, summer uh, students. At least they can not only, uh, you know, they can earn uh, a little bit of pocket change. Yeah, uh, nice, nice. And help mom and dad. Yeah. Well, I don't yeah. know about <laughs> I'm buying my own stuff, yeah. yeah. You know, you know it, it, well, Joe, you know, it's great. I'm so glad you came in. Now we have a, a company that we can call for all these different services, whether I'm a large contractor, small contractor, homeowner, investor, I'm a realtor. I mean, I could call one person, one company, and it's all taken care of. Yes, sir. Man, yes, sir. Joe, we thank you for coming in. Shop. Amen Thanks to that. Thank, yeah, okay, appreciate thank you. your time. Thank you very much. See you later, Adios, guys. everybody.